Hi guys, welcome back to Cozy Home. I first want to apologize for my camera for being so blurry lately. Um, if you guys had followed me on Instagram, I think a week or so ago, I had broke my lens off on my camera and um, I haven't been able to fix it all the way. My husband did an amazing job of getting it to work again and I still had to go out and buy another piece for my camera. So that's why it gets so blurry once in a while, but um, I had did a DIY project on Ryder's room um, a while back during the summertime. So I'm going to be sharing that process with, with you guys. Um, um, I redid his bed frame, I spray painted it and everything. I'm trying to get more of a kind of like a grown-up teenager um, bedroom for him. I still haven't figured out all the stuff I want to do for his room, but I just wanted to go ahead and share what I have done already. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up. And also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Here is um, a month or so after I get done doing his bed frame. I'm just gonna go ahead and tidy up his room. And hopefully I'm able to add his plant in here. I'm going to first start off by making his bedding. I just got done with his sheets and blankets. So we're going to go ahead and tidy up his bed. And then I'm going to go ahead and pick up on his room. His room isn't really bad. So mainly what I have to do is the floors and um, making his bed. Welcome back and welcome if you're new. My name is Jacqueline. I'm so glad that you decided to check out my channel. I'm a wife of 15 years. We have three teenagers and two dogs. If you like cleaning videos and cleaning motivations and power hours, organizations, some plant-based recipes, and um, somewhat of attempt of decorating i'm still learning how to decorate i'm not good at it guys but i try my best and it, that's what counts if that is up your alley and you guys are enjoying that that type of video please subscribe to my channel and leave a comment below so that we get to know each other and we can become friends here on instagram or <laughs> on youtube and you can also follow me on instagram You guys are probably wondering why I'm not using my vacuum cleaner. I normally use it, but lately I've just been enjoying sweeping the old fashioned way. Just because I'm, I get to see the pile piled up at the end. And it's just so satisfying to me lately. Um, if you guys like this type of cleaning and you like to see the broom action more than the vacuum cleaning action, let me know in the comments below because so far i'm just enjoying sweeping it's been a while since i picked up a good broom and swept so if you guys like that let me know if you guys are interested in me painting my son's bed i have posted it on a new channel called this cozy home pins it's all about pinterest pins that i have I'm going to leave a link down in the description for that video. Right here, I am trying to find a good spot to put Ryder's flower. This is going to be a temporarily until I get his macaray plant hanger made. This plant is called a string of bananas because it looks like little bananas on here. I thought it was so cute and unique. I got this plant at Home Depot for $11.
Okay, you guys are probably wondering why I am putting Ryder's diffuser underneath his bed. He doesn't like the diffusers on the dresser. I think it's the little um, noises it makes or it's the light that it lights up that causes him to throw it across the room. So that's why I put it underneath his bed. I had found this picture that I wanted to put right here above his TV. It was a black and white with some gray intones. It was like a landscape picture. And I should have got it the day I saw it. They didn't have it, I found it at Ross. And I went back the next day to pick it up and it was gone. So now I'm looking for a couple more art pieces to put up here. My plant stand, or my plant right here, that's just temporarily. I'm going to make a macaray um, plant hanger that will go down here in the corner and uh, eventually I'm going to be taking out uh, my filing cabinet out of here and then hopefully I could find a different thing for Ryder's toys because um, this doesn't match anymore in his room so I'm going to go ahead and give this um, army trunk back to my husband so he could display his army um rewards and his coins and all that stuff in that trunk so he's gonna be able to have something like that for him um what do you guys think about his bed frame i absolutely love it guys i'm glad i decided to go ahead and spray paint it black i think it makes it look a lot cleaner and his room more of a teenage um young adult if you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Also, leave a comment below. And if you have, haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. And I am so excited to share this video with you guys. So, I want to share that um, this hamper I got at a thrift store for $3. It had their tag on it and everything. I'm not for sure why they got rid of it. There was a little rip here. Maybe that's why they got rid of it and they donated it to the thrift store. But I was so happy to go ahead and pick up that awesome hamper for Ryder. Um, this pillow right here I got at a thrift store. I went ahead and cleaned it and got a new insert for it. So it's really nice. All I just have to do is... Um, put a black button on there. I'm going to take one of Logan's. And then this was my favorite find right here. This curtain was a um, thrift find also. And I actually only paid $2 for this huge curtain. And it's a blackout curtain and it is from Ikea. So I was so excited to find one of these. I'm going to look for um, another curtain that I could, that's a black out, but maybe like with the same type of tones. And then I'm going to cut it in half to add here because these are small windows. I don't want it to hold the whole thing down on the ground. I thought maybe doing two small ones right there or just the two long ones. So what do you guys think about me cutting a curtain in half and putting it here? Or should I go ahead and have a long one? Let me know in the comments below. I'm not that good with curtains. Um, I do have to put a curtain rod up here. But let me know guys. I'm so excited about giving Ryder a makeover in his room.